Hey guys, Jared here again, AKA The Laughing Man. And I'm actually having a really good day. I'm super ecstatic. Uh, so I ordered some stuff for my quadcopter. It hasn't come in yet, but my wife got me an early birthday present and I'm extremely happy about it. So, uh, because we're going to Italy and I was complaining about my Surface Pro 2 so much, she uh, got me the Surface Book. I mean, I could sit here and complain that it's only the i5 version, but Hey, it's better than my Surface Pro 2, and I'm extremely, extremely happy. So, let's go ahead and do a quick unboxing with it. Again, this one here is the... Uh, this one is the uh, Intel Core i5 with 128 gigs and 8 gigs of RAM. All right. Oh yeah. Sorry about all the lighting issues. Okay. First and foremost, let's go ahead and pull the book out. I'll just set that to the side for right now. All right. Going to the right side here. Let's see here. Okay, so in here we have the power charging brick, which is much smaller than the one for my Surface Pro 2. So, there's that, it's a US connector, and their new connector. I know I'm kind of late to the game on, on getting one of these and unboxing it, so I'm sorry guys. Uh, and here, this is just going to be your literature and stuff like that. Don't really care about that. I don't read any of it. And, of course, the new pen. This is what I'm really happy about and excited. Uh, so this one's a magnetic one. If I can shut it off again. Oh, well. So it's magnetic, sticks to the side of it. Really happy with that, or about that, I should say. Let's see if there's anything underneath. All right, nothing underneath. So it's just a really heavy box here. All right, let's go ahead and open this up real quick. All right, so let's go ahead and unwrap this boy real quick. All right, here's an Alvis Glory. The main reason I wanted to switch to this over the Surface Pro 2 that I have right now is I have the uh, touch cover, which is nice for being low profile, but really hard to type on in this. Everybody says it has a really good keyboard and trackpad. All right. Nice little screen protector there. Oh yeah. That's gonna be nice to type on. So I'm gonna be doing some uh, mild video editing on this. Uh, I mean, nothing too terribly crazy, so I'm assuming this should work just fine. So SD card, the Thunderbolt connection. Looks like it. All right, let's go ahead and fire it up for the first time here, huh? All right, so it looks like the battery's completely dead. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, plug it in, get it some charge on it, and I'll be right back. All right, so I just plugged it in real quick. Now let's try turning it on. Of course, now Jet wants to go over it. All 
right, so here we are. I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick setup on it and uh, come back as soon as I log in. All right, guys, so I got it all set up and logged in and everything, and uh, everything seems to be working pretty good on it. Uh, so I just wanted to do a quick size comparison between the Surface Pro 2 and the Surface Book here. Uh, as you can tell, it's much uh, larger as far as screen size goes, as well as even in book form. Uh, this is with the full touch style, uh, uh, or even with the full keyboard and everything, uh, the Surface Book is actually still thinner than the uh, Surface Pro 2. And weight wise, I mean, this thing is a brick. So I don't know the exact uh, weight and everything of it. Um, but uh, this one here is lighter, especially when you take off the screen. Which, let's go ahead and open this up here. Oh, do my facial lo uh, login real quick. Uh, sorry about that. I had to do facial login, which is kind of cool. Pretty sure you can disable it if you want to. Uh, but I'm going to keep it for now. Um, so, yeah, uh, it pulls my uh, a desktop background from my other uh, computer, which is pretty cool. Um, you know, spent like an hour doing all the updates after I logged in and everything. Um, no, I'm, I'm really excited about it. So, this is the coolest feature. <gasps> uh, it's so small and thin and light, and you can carry it. Of course. But, uh, no, like I said, I'm really excited about this. And the uh, main thing I'm going to be doing with this is going to be some video editing and everything for uh, while I'm on the go. Um, so I'm really hoping that it works well for that. And when we bought it, it also came with, uh, you know, the military appreciation version of the Office 365. So you get a you know, $65 value free. So it should be awesome to get this installed. And, uh, yeah, maybe I can... Actually, spell check some of my stuff before I post it, but I'm not gonna hold my breath. So, but anyway, guys, this is just like I said, a, a quick uh, a look at it. Um, I know there's a thousand uh, unboxing and reviews out there, but I want to go ahead and do it anyways because I was excited about it. And because I'm going to be doing this with uh, using this for video editing, uh, I'm actually going to be editing this video on this. So we'll see how well that goes. Uh, Anyways, guys, like I said, I'm going to go ahead and start cleaning out my garage. I hope you guys have a good week. Thanks.